Nicole, the former president, will take the stage in about two and a half hours with media personality Tucker Carlson. This is the former president's third visit to Arizona just this month. He was at ASU last week. He was at Prescott Valley the week before that. Behind me, you can see the crowd here at Desert Diamond Arena is beginning to fill in. We've seen a lot of people wearing these orange or yellow safety vests, garbage vests. That's a reference to what Trump was wearing yesterday on the campaign trail, highlighting some comments made by uh, President Joe Biden. Uh, so far, we've sp spoken with a lot of Trump supporters, a lot of folks who have been with the former president since 2016. These are hardcore supporters. And uh, we met uh, two of them who flew in from Cleveland, Ohio, to see their first Trump event. Uh, Mike and Charlene Herchik have been unwavering Trump supporters since 2016, but they say they've noticed something different about the former president recently. President Trump is a true family man. He has a sincere heart, and I don't know when it happened, but he found God, and he's a well-spoken Christian now, and I like that. Earlier today, Trump was in Henderson, Nevada, and in Albuquerque, New Mexico. New Mexico is not one of the seven battleground states that most political observers think will decide the election, but Trump's campaign feels confident they are going for states uh, that are kind of reach states for most Republican presidential candidates. And today, they released a polling analysis uh, based on real clear politics' as polling averages, looking at this time in the race and back in 2020, five days out from election day and it shows that Donald Trump is polling about seven percent better nationally here in Arizona he was basically tied in 2020 with President Biden this time around this average shows that he's up two and a half percent we should note that is still within the margin of error reporting live in Glendale I'm Derek Stahl for Arizona's family